Previously in the seventh episode, Liger started making some good profit. I may just take 0.7 keys loss on this one. Oh shit, wrong clip. All right, and on this trade, I'm buying this unusual for 29 and a half keys. The buyers are paying 23 and a half, but SCN is paying 28 and a half keys. So he initially wanted 30 keys for it, right? I told him that if SCN just gets one in stock, I'm gonna be screwed because if this buy offer is gone, like I'm gonna be with this buy offers. But the catch here, look at this graph. Like only yesterday, there were bots buying at 28. They just gone for today and I'm expecting them to be back because they've been here for so long. And there we go, we just got the unusual. It's an R class, which is always very good. And this could be down, it's nice too, so yeah, I'm happy with this unusual. And there we go, we're left with these two unusuals and 147 keys plus these three finds. Alright, to the next trade. Alright, and on this trade, I'm trading my heavy unusual that I got for my scout unusual that I paid 14 keys for. So basically, I paid 14 keys for this one. I'm trading it for this unusual, scout unusual, plus 4 keys and this item, which is like 50 refines. His unusual has a buy order at 10.2 keys, right? Which is really good. Plus 4 keys, that's already 14.2 keys. If I sell to this, that's instantly like 0.2 keys profit plus this thing that he added it which is like 50 refines so let's say this is like a nearly one key profit if i sell directly into this so my old unusual had this buy order that keeps going in and out in and out you see this um this is so bad by the way because it keeps dropping the buy orders to 12 keys and stn was paying 12 keys as well but if we take a look to his unusual it had a buy order that's doing the same it keeps going on and off you see this but the thing is with his unusual stn is paying 10 and 70 refines which is always like near this buy order that's at least a bit of safety for me i mean even if i sell to stn i'm profiting like a key right so yeah that's that's really good also let's not forget that this unusual has way too much margin that uh, my old unusual did my old unusual had like five keys margin not even but this one has eight keys margin for anyone that doesn't know the margin is the gap between the buyers and the sellers which is the range that you could profit on i could sell it for like 12 keys or something just got the items i'm probably just gonna quick sell this for pure to be honest this is also a soldier in jewel which is not bad at all the hat is bad the effect is decent i'm not gonna complain because this is profit even if i sell to buy orders right now all right and i just organized everything now we are back into these two unusuals plus these two unusuals and 151 and a half keys with this refines so that's basically like 152 keys catch you guys in the next trade and i had to put my serum plasma unusual in the auction um, since i was profiting if i sell it to buy orders anyway so i, I decided to put it in scrap.tf auctions with no minimum bid at all no minimum bids always have a high chance for you to profit from um because people just want the item since it has no i mean i don't know why but they just keep overbidding each other and yeah so buyers were at 10 25 sellers at 15 almost and i managed to get 11 keys for it um initially I traded my scout unusual which was so hard to sell for the manoir unusual and then I traded the manoir unusual for this and the guy that I traded with decided to add 4 keys and a half so I paid 14 keys for the very first unusual that I got and now I sold this for 11 keys right plus um, almost 5 keys so that's two keys in profit and there we go i just got the keys um now we have nearly 163 keys plus this all class unusual and these two unusuals that we got to sell it's hard to make profit out of this because i paid lots of them but yeah i'm gonna just wait and see see if i get anything for this in the future and yeah to the next trade and on this trade i'm selling my all class unusual that i got for 29 and a half keys for 32 keys um, which is two and a half keys profit. Yeah, so one thing that helped me selling this unusual real fast, 
backed by orders climbed and they are nearing towards STM paying right now and on top of that the seller at 42 keys disappeared he was listing for that amount for a year and he didn't have the unusual i reported him for not having the item that's his listing and they took off his sell order look at this now that helped me a lot just got the keys let me enjoy my moment clicking through pure dude let's go all right i just organized the inventory and now we're sitting at 100 and 94 keys and a half um yeah plus we still have these two unusuals that i'm trying to sell so i just had a trade with this guy resounding he was watching my series and he decided to give away some stuff so thank you a lot for that dude. and on this trade i found this bot selling this unusual for 12 keys and a half the buy orders are at 11 keys and the sell orders are at 16 keys there is only one sell order which is a bot at 16 keys giving me a little range to profit on uh, thing is stn is paying 12 keys and 40 fines for it so a half key above i'm positive i can sell this at least for a half key profit uh, maybe a little bit more if i hold into it but i doubt i will do that and here is how the unusual looks actually not bad dude not bad at all and here is the inventory. Catch you guys in the next trade. Alright, and on this trade, I'm buying one of the most unusuals I've ever bought in my life. Um, so I'm paying 133 keys for this scout misc. It has smoking effect, which doesn't match with most of unusuals to be honest but yeah the reason i did that is that because 133 keys is so close to buy orders buy orders are at 128 and sellers are at 165 so that's a tons of range to profit on as well too many contests too many sellers so it's gonna be hard to sell also priced only like seven months ago at 156 the thing i'm worried about here is the full price and this buyer he can cancel out any moment but yeah frost is a trusted buyer so yeah and yeah there we go let me check my sexy little lady brah it looks like I have a smoke and killer exclusive. Yeah, that's why misks are good. Unfortunately though, I don't have any other unusual to pair it with this one. But yeah, I'm gonna try and get other unusuals for scout just to pair it and see how it looks. Let me check this in game real quick. And there we go. I'm flexing my uh, unusual on bots of course, because why not? Um, yeah, I, I can't wait to pair it with another unusual. I'm, I'm gonna try and get scout unusual just to see how this looks like. And here is how we look now. These two unusuals plus 49 and a half keys. Also, I still have these two unusuals. I kept rising my buy order and they kept overcutting me until they came back to where they were at, at 13 keys. Um, so yeah, this is not bad. Also, look at this. I got this unusual for 14 keys before Gladiator shut down. So now I have hopes for selling it back for at least 14 keys i've noticed this thing a lot if the bots pain under stn if you're trying to overcut them they will keep overcutting you and that's gonna make the price rise that was just a small tip if you guys trying to sell hats that the bots pain under stn just overcut them and they will rise up i mean if you look at this i start overcutting and they go like crazy see this um same thing here yeah you start overcutting and they start go up and yeah catch you guys in the next trade so i paid 18 keys and 20 refines um which is like a half key above a cm buy orders which is so good it has no sellers dude the sellers used to be at 25 keys i don't know about the seller at 177 but yeah that's just a half key above buy orders and i'm very positive i can turn back so much profit on this hat um so yeah here is how the angel lo looks not bad at all dude and now we're left with like around um 30 keys and a half and yeah to the next trade boys in this trade i'm paying 28 keys pure plus the unusual i bought for 12 and a half keys yeah and i'm getting this sunbeams all class unusual which has very good hopes to go for way more initially i paid 
12 and a half keys for this bro the buy orders were at 11 keys i pop in with a buy order at 12 and a half keys which i don't mind by any means so if anyone sells to me at that i'm gonna take it and look to the bots bro they go in hella up like if you have a new one bro just pop in a buy order like a half a key or a key above bots and they will climb up so yeah i paid 12 and a half for this one and I'm adding 28 keys. So basically I'm paying 40 keys and a half for his unusual. His unusual has buyers at 38. Astian is buying at nearly 38 and a half. The thing that I like about this unusual is the margin. It has a very good margin and yeah, very good gap to profit on. So I just send him a trade offer um, because trade is crashing. And I just got the unusual. I can't wait to test this on the scout, bro. Double unusual effects. Let's fucking go, dude. <laughs> and they are both painted black, dude. Dude, that's sick, actually. Yeah, first time having combo effects. And yeah, some beams is not bad at all. It's all class. But I'm happy that I have double effects for the first time in my life. And there we go. I actually did withdraw the other initials I had in Marketplace as well. So now we are left with this five initials plus two keys and a half, nearly three keys. All right, and... On this trade, I'm reselling the scout misc I just got for 134 keys. Um, that's only a key profit. And the reason I'm doing this trade really because the buy order that was at 127 dropped to 125. So yeah, that's gonna be a little bit harder to sell now. The low seller is at 165. So that's a small margin to profit on. Plus the most obvious reason that made me do this trade is because like, that's literally most of my pure so i can buy more unusuals um yeah so i just take this one key profit and i wanted to click through the whole keys and you know just clicking through pure is fun and make you guys watch what i'm doing so but you know i just realized that i only made one key profit on like a high tier unusual trade uh, which is so bad actually but yeah i just wanted the pure back just so i can buy more unusuals to resell so now we are down to this four unusuals and um, plus 136 keys pure and a half all right if you made it all the way through here that means you enjoyed the video so help me back by liking and subscribing and peace